everyone welcome to the channel yes so today we're making ice cream yes we made this ice cream before we have an ice cream recipe on my channel this same ice cream recipe on my channel but i'm doing this because somebody asked how many pieces i would be able to get from the recipe actually in that recipe i didn't count how many pieces i got but what i'm doing today is a double of that recipe so my target is i'm targeting to have about 60 to 65 pieces yes so and i'm sure that this recipe will be able to give me up to that amount so let's get started so in here i have my two cup of flour yes i have my seven cup of water here i have my four tablespoon of margarine yes i have my whisk and my wooden spoon so all i'll just do is to set all this aside while i go into the mixing so what you will do is you add some water do not add all then you what you will do is to use your whisk to whisk it you know when flour and water come into contact there's always this reaction it's either the flour wouldn't want to mix well or something so you shouldn't add a, um, too much water just add a little at a time yes the aim is we want to make sure that the flour melts completely yes so that's the aim we want to make sure that the flour melts completely so all we just do now is to mix 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 till it melts so as time goes on we will add water as time goes on yes so you keep on mixing 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 yes please if you mix and you notice that there are some lumps in this mixture all you have to just do is to sieve just sieve it if you notice that there are lumps in it just make sure to go in and sieve yes just sieve it once you notice that there are lumps just go in and sieve it so that you'll be on a safe side yes so all i'll just do now is to mix continuously till i see that it is totally and completely smooth yes so as you can see there are still some few lumps yes so all i'll just do is to continue mixing so you mix 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 yes sorry about my background noises today i have a lot of children around so normally what i normally do is i go out to stop them from coming close when i'm recording but today you know i needed to do something very fast so i couldn't go out to tell them so sorry about the background noises so at this point it has milled completely so all i'll just do now is to add a little more water and then i'll take it to my gas stove yes so the remaining water i'll add it while the flour mixture is cooking yes so don't worry about that so this is what we are looking for have you seen very smooth yes so all we we'll do now is to take it to the gas stop and com and complete it yeah yes guys so we are here now all we we'll just do now is to stir continue stirring do not stop stirring stir 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 till it becomes like a paste yes so make sure to stir over and over and over and over again yes yes so you continue stirring until you start seeing lumps do not stop continue yes in that motion yes so you see lumps as if you are making a cam when you are making the lumps that forms when you are making a cam or when you are making cocoa yes don't worry just continue in that motion everything would form together well do not stop because once you stop then there's trouble just continue in that motion yes your hands may feel achy but don't worry just continue continue because we are aiming to form a thick paste yes so just continue in that motion yeah so as you can see it's becoming thick and thick so all you just do continue do not stop just continue continue like that yes do not stop just continue continue yes so all you just do is to beat it to the side yes so that every lumps can break yes before we add the final water yes yeah, so all i'll just do is to add the remaining of my water the one we added at the beginning all of it then all we just do is to go in and mix.
Yeah, so I've gotten to the consistency I need. All I'll just do now is to add our margarine. Yes. So add all of it. Yes. So I'll just go in and use my hands. My hands are clean. They are washed. Yeah, so all I'll just do now is to go in and mix it till the margarine dissolves. Yes, guys. So sorry I couldn't show you the end of the flour mixture. My phone was a little bit hot, so it was overheating. So let's get into the mixing. So in here, I have my two cup plus eight tablespoons of milk powder. In the other recipe, I use condensed milk instead of sugar. But in this recipe, I'll be using sugar, my evaporated milk, my vanilla essence, and my water. So all I'll just do now is to mix. I'll set my water aside here. Then all I'll just do is to go in and mix my sugar with the milk. The reason why I'm mixing I'm mixing the sugar with the milk is that I do not want the case whereby when I'm adding the water it would start forming lumps. So all I'll just do now is to mix this very well. You mix it very very well. Yes. It's milk ice cream so you need a lot of milk. Yes. Yeah, so this is two cup of milk plus one plus eight tablespoon of powdered milk. Yes, so all I'll just do now is to go in and add my evap my evaporated milk, all of it. Yes, so all I'll just do is to rinse it out because all has to go in. Yes, so what I'll do now is to just mix. Mix, 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 mix gradually. Yes, so what I'll do now is to add my water in bits. Do not add all so that it wouldn't form lumps. But in case after mixing you find lumps, all you just have to do is to sieve the whole thing. Yes, so I will be sieving in case I see any lumps. Yes, but if there's no lumps, you are good to go. That's fine. So all you just do is to mix, mix, mix. This is a commercial one. I'm selling this. I'm going to sell this. I'm doing this for a client. Yes, so all I'll just do is to mix, 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 mix. Yes, you have to just mix. So what I'll do now, I'll go in and add one tablespoon of vanilla essence. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes, yeah, so all I'll just do now is to mix. So I'll add in more water. Yes. You do this till the sugar dissolves completely. Yes, so all I'll just do now is to add my flour mixture to this goodness. Yes, all of it. Make sure to add everything. Remember, like I said, I said earlier that if you see any lumps, just be ready to sift out any, you know, to sift it out. Yes. So all you just do is to mix. So now you go in with your water and just mix. Make sure to mix. Everything should mix very well. So I can still see some lumps. So what I'll do is, after mixing, I'm going to just sift this goodness. Then I'll show you the end product. I'm going to sift it off camera so that I can be quick with it. Yes, then I'll show you the, the real deal yeah so that is it so i'll add in the last part of my water yes so all you just do is to mix mix so that everything will mix well the sugar and everything the milk everything will mix in very well yes so i'm just going to taste hmm so delicious it's not too sweet you know the sugar is on point it's not too sweet it's just everything you need in an ice cream so let me sift this then i'll come back and show you the end product yeah yes guys so this is it i've sifted it so all i'll just do is to set this aside while i prep my other ingredient yeah so this is a cup i'll be using to to fetch this is the remaining of my cup so i'm doing I'm doing some cups, some with cups and sticks, while I'm doing the others with rubber. Yes. So this is my wooden sticks, and this is the rubber I'll be using. Yes. Yeah, so if you want to go into the business and you want to use rubber, just when you get to the shops, ask them for ice cream 
rubber. Yes. So all I'll just do now is to arrange my cups. Yes. So I'm just doing. I think I'm doing about forty pieces of cups. Then the remaining will be with rubber. Yes, because they are sharing it for children with different age sizes. Yes. So all I'm just doing now is to arrange my cups. Then I'll just start scooping it in. Yes. So if you want to go into this business, it's something easy. You know, it's very easy to access all the ingredients. Yes. You go to shops where they sell takeaways. Yes, where they sell takeaway packs. That's where you get these ice cream cups. Yes. So that is it. So my target is to have 40 pieces of the cup ones. Then the remaining 25 pieces for the the rubber ones yes because i don't have a big space another thing too i don't have a big space yes and also what they order what they ordered for is what i'm also doing too so yes yes so that is it so all i'll just do now is to start scooping so you have a particular measurement you work with so these days um spoon i normally use it's my measuring spoon it's one third of my measuring spoon yes so i have that measurement so all i'll just do is to scoop yes Yeah, so all I'll just do now is to add in my sticks one after the other. Yes, so just add in your sticks one after the other. Yes, so with this one, with my other video, I didn't fill it to this to the brim. But with this one, I have a lot of the the butter looks much. So what I'll be doing is that I I made it full, full, full. Like I made the ice cream very full. Yes, so with my other video, it wasn't really full like this, but with this one, it's very full. So they will have to enjoy more ice cream. Yeah, so all I'm just doing now is to drop in my sticks one after the other. Yes. So that is it. So I think I got about 40 pieces of the cup ice cream. So I'm going to set this aside, then I'll show you how to tie your um, rubber ice cream yeah yeah so i've just said that in my freezer so all i'll just do now is to show you how to measure with your rubber yes so it's a little bit um how do i call it slant so all you just do is to for so what i'm doing is this measurement is for the adults, the, the adult children. Yes, so this is how you tie it. Yes, guys, so I'm done. Yes, so I'm done, 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 done. Yeah, so let's count and know how many we got for the rubber. So this is two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty one. So we actually gave two parts of you can even see the size yes so the ice cream had two parts whilst the cup had just one one part so the ice cream they with the rubber is a little bit more so this took more of the ice cream so the rubber took more of the ice cream compared to the cup it's actually the cup that i've been doing i've actually this is my first time doing the rubber so the kind is someone i know so i'll just explain to her i didn't get the quantity i wanted because i had to double this up yes yeah, so in total we had 21 of the rubber and 40 of the cup. So that's 61. Yeah, so we had 61 pieces. So I'll just explain instead of 65, I'll just explain to the client. So if you are making the cup, you will get more than 70 pieces because in here we made two, two. We gave two parts of the cup. The cup was just one part and this was two parts. So if you are making with the cup, you will make more than 70 pieces of the cup size. And even with the cup, I had to fill it up. Yeah, so you make more than 70 pieces. Yes, guys, so what I'll be doing now is that 
I'll be freezing this for seven hours. Then after the seven hours, I will show you how this goodness looks like. Yes, guys. So I'll show you how it looks like after seven hours. Yes. So let me send it to the freezer and you'll see. Yes, guys. So this is it. Can you see how beautiful they look? Yes, so I wouldn't be opening it any of this one because I told you earlier that it's for a client. So I just wanted to show you. So this is how it is. This is how it looks. Can you see? This is how they frozen and the rubber and um, cup one looks like. So this is it. Yes, so I wouldn't be opening it because it's for a client. Yes, guys. So thank you so, so much for watching. Please don't forget that one day at a time is the best. Please don't forget to like this video. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Don't forget to hit the notification bell below. So that when we upload a new video, you'll be the first to be notified. So we'll meet in our next video. Please stay safe and bye.